Hey YouTube, me and my wife are installing the anodizing exhaust on the Yamaha R3. I got it for her for her anniversary for our anniversary. I said for her anniversary <laughs> <laughs> for our anniversary, and um, we just want to go ahead and, and just you know test it out. We just took the big heavy stock exhaust off, um, and it's heavy as hell. So uh, I'll definitely keep you posted. The next video will be everything installed and us actually running the bike. Um, we're uploading this because we really don't see any anodizing videos and you know it's pretty easy for me and my wife to install this so and uh, she's pretty excited about it can't wait to hear it her R3 she's about to turn into a stunt R3 now so it's getting ready to look ruthless alright y'all part two's coming Go. hey YouTube just finished installing the anodizing exhaust on my wife's Yamaha R3 so just kinda wiping down all the fingerprints and stuff off of it right now um, it was pretty straightforward install um, it wasn't hard at all. The only thing is is they, they gave us something inside the muffler that slid into this section and we had to essentially slide it down into here as deep as we could. Right now, um, this is essentially just going to be here for right now. I actually have a buddy of mine who welds. I'm about to have him weld all of this up. Obviously this is going to come off and then um, all of this is going to be welded up into essentially one full exhaust. So right now this is here just for, you know, just for right now so that we can essentially start it up uh, just to clamp that metal down real nice and tight. Uh, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about when you order this exhaust because I'm pretty sure you're watching the YouTube video just because you're you're like, what the hell, just like we were. <laughs> but um, you know, our fix for that right now is, is, is this clamp and we're getting longer springs because these two springs were just too short, essentially. So, um, that's it, man. And uh, the exhaust is nice and clean. The factory exhaust is extremely heavy, beyond belief. I'm trying to be quick so that uh, my wife can go ahead and start the bike up. Take your time, baby. Give me one minute. <laughs> but uh, the exhaust is extremely light. I can't believe how light it is. Alright. Oh, we gotta take that baffle out. Yeah, true, true. That's why I have her YouTube. <laughs> Alright, and it's out. Wind. It's extremely windy right now. And uh, me and my wife, we don't run baffles. <laughs> Alright, come on. I made sure this was the right size. There we go. You guys are gonna see how to take out the anodizing baffle. Baffle, thanks, babe. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a big baffle too. Yeah, right. It's a long one. All right. So now I shall pull out. Sorry, shall oh, you're pull fine. out the baffle. Yeah. Let me hold the muffler. Give a, I always give them a little wibble wobble. And we yeah. got the ugly thing out. Oh man, this thing's gonna sound crazy. Oh, it's about to sound right, awesome. So now I'm gonna trade off with my wife here on the camera. And right. I'm gonna let my beautiful queen start up her beautiful R3 with the anodizing. So excited. I know it. Oh! It's so loud. Hey, I bet it's not even really I bet it's not really even leaking from around here. It's not because we have it clamped down so much. Oh, man. Right? Isn't that crazy? Oh. If anything, I mean like I I like the the slightest little leak ever, but I mean it's only for the meantime. Oh, wow. She's definitely kicking out of here. Oh yeah. Right now we got to let it warm up before we just Hit the throttle, y'all. So it's a cold start. Look at the beautiful queen. Yeah, we're turning her R3 into a stunt bike. Oh, yeah. She got the unbreakable levers, fellas. Unbreakable levers. <laughs> Listen to that motherfucker. Oh, go. Yeah. Look at, the, look at the craftsmanship. Look at the craftsmanship. Right? 
Oh, it sounds so loud. Here, um, hold the camera real quick. Let me make sure that those header bolts are nice and tight. Yes, sir. Yeah, I need to tighten them down a little bit more. Okay. <laughs> All right, YouTube, just uh, stay tuned. Please go ahead and hit the stop, little mama. We'll be right back. <laughs> that all right, YouTube, take three of the anodizing exhaust. So yeah, those header bolts, about those header bolts, they were a little bit loose. <laughs> we're really excited, YouTube. Yeah, we're, we're really excited, as you can tell. Long, long, long All right, little mama, fire her back on up. All right. Fuel injection. Oh, yes. Oh, yay. Nice. God, it sounds so loud. I love it. Yeah, uh, in, the, in, the, in the original uh, video before this, or shall I say clip before this, um, the header bolts, they were, they were pretty tight, but they weren't like torque torque. Uh, but, uh, you know, obviously it still sounds the exact same. Nice and loud. Hold on now. Is she, is she getting up there in temperature? All right, good. Oh, my God, dude. That is so fucking loud. Oh, shit. Um. Oh. <laughs> Oh, my wife's about to be terrorizing the streets, y'all. Oh, damn. Well, uh, if you were wondering, uh, you know, about getting the anodizing exhaust, I would just go ahead and, uh, and make that purchase. Pretty cheap, y'all. God, that sounds crazy. Oh, and we got the R6 quick throttle. Yep, R6 quick throttle. Hey, ECU reflash is coming next. Alright y'all, stay tuned for the R3 project. <laughs> 